decade sparks frenzy as Duchess makes important change to appearance in latest engagement. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, sparked a frenzy among royal commentators as they revealed the royal finally made a change they had been waiting for with bated breath. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, delighted royal commentators when she was finally spotted wearing a face mask. The royal was pictured wearing a floral covering during a visit to local charity, Baby Basics, and then again at the Shire Hall Care Home in Wales. Royally obsessed podcast hosts Roberta Fiorito and Rachel Bowie discuss why this particular mask was a great pick for the Duchess. Ms. Bowie told listeners, the big reveal is that Kate wore a mask, and that is a huge deal. We've been waiting with bated breath for her to wear one. She stepped out to a baby bank and the mask that she wore is a Maya. It's a kid's brand in London and it cost £15. She continued, 30% of the proceeds go to the NHS according to their site. It's a great pick for her to wear that one and she's worn it a few times already. The commentators also spoke about how Princess Eugenie tied into Kate's choice. Ms. Fiorito said, Eugenie connected this brand, Amaya which is a royal go-to for kids' clothing. She added, she connected them to NHS charities and hospitals through Instagram. I thought that was so nice and it's clear the royals are working together, albeit online and socially distanced. They're really working together to get these masks to people in need, which is really lovely. The Duchess sparked concern in July when she attended one of her first in-person engagements since the pandemic without a mask. She had joined families from East Anglia's Children's Hospices, EACH. The meetings took place outside as she helped to plant a garden at the Nook, one of the charity's purpose-built hospices. Both Ms. Fiorito and Ms. Bowie noted at the time that Kate had not been very socially distanced from other people, but by that point the two-meter rule had been ditched in favor of one meter plus. Currently in England, it is only mandatory to wear a face covering on public transport and in shops.